I missed, I think, what's the coolest property of Pascal Strain. Um, tell me, I know it's not the whole triangle, obviously, but it's enough to see the pattern. How many prime numbers are there in Pascal's triangle? <laughs> no, seriously, look at it. How many prime numbers are there? Is one a prime number? No. Two's prime? Three's prime? Seven's prime? Five's prime? Eleven's prime? I know there's symmetry, so of course you get them over here. Where are the rest of the primes? What about in here? Are you telling me there are no primes in here? Yes. Okay, there's the first thing. Number one, number one, there are no primes in here. But that's not the real mind blow. Watch, watch. Have a look at those rows which have those prime numbers in them. Let's have a look at row number five. Do you notice anything unusual about the numbers in it? Or how about row seven? It's even more suspicious. Now, I know row number 11, you probably don't recognize these numbers, but you can make a pretty educated guess, can't you? Get this. Number one. There are no primes except for in the Z plus... Of course, there have to be primes here. Like, it's all of them. But where you do get a prime, in every row that has a prime, all of the terms are multiples of the prime. What is up with that? Have a good recess, everyone. I'll see you tomorrow.